And then she came across the room and cupped my head and punched me five or six times. And she kneed me in the face and knocked me out. And when I came to, my coworker was dragging me across the floor of the ED away from her because she was trying to do it again. I got into emergency medicine because I wanted to care for people, but I didn't go into emergency medicine to watch my colleagues get stabbed by a patient with kitchen shears. Violence has become a daily occurrence in our hospitals. I, I was knocked unconscious by a patient. Patients have tried to stab me. Patients have spit on me. Clawed, bitten. I took punches to the face. Hit me in the left side of my face. One of my nursing colleagues was uh, beaten about the face with a plastic lunch tray. Punched kicked, spit on. All of this is piling emotional, physical, and psychological trauma on people who are already under intense strain. Uh, I've personally suffered PTSD from an attack, and it's pushing our EDs to a breaking point. Violence in our department doesn't just affect our staff. It's pretty hard to provide quality patient care when you're stitching up your colleagues' face. If I could tell patients one thing to remember when interacting with healthcare providers, it's that we are people and we are here to help. We're humans too. I am here to care for you, not to be your punching bag.